Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel. So again, I'm out fertilized spreading as you can see behind me. Uh, I'm actually in the hay field right now. We just had a load of more fertilizer that just came about an hour ago. And I just finished spreading the hay field. So what we're actually going to be doing is unhooking this because we are renting this. This is not ours. And I'm going to unhook it down here. And then tomorrow, after I get done with school, I'm going to take this tractor over to the second farm. And we're going to move some things around. Maybe do some planter work. And possibly a whole bunch of different things. So I hope you guys enjoy this video. I'm going to stop real quick. See if I have anything left. Sounds like there's some stuff coming out still. Yep. So this stuff looks a little bit different last, from last time. Uh, this is kind of a mix of nitrogen, potash. I think you said there's some zinc in here. Uh, and a bunch of different kind of stuff for the hay. So since there's a little bit left, I'm probably gonna go up and down these rows a few times. Because I want to make sure this is empty. So that tomorrow morning, the company that owns that thing can pick it up right away. So I just ran out of fertilizer. So I'm actually going to go and hook this now. here looks good nice flat surface okay. so gonna lower the jack down take the PTO out and the hydraulic out. Good. Pop the pin out. Okay, I believe this pin comes with this. So it should be free now. I'm probably going to drive part the tractor somewhere else. That way they can come and pick it up in the morning. Good right here. So I'm going to shut it off. 
So tomorrow afternoon after school, I'm gonna come right out here, start the tractor, and take this tractor down to the second farm. So I'll see you tomorrow. Okay, so it's the next day. It's a bit chilly out here right now. I just got back from school. So I'm gonna start this tractor. I do have to do a little bit of hot wiring because Something with the ignition uh, doesn't work right now, so we do gotta get that fixed. So basically, definitely make sure it's out of gear, parking brakes on, so push the gas in, turn the key. Got a little wire here. started Okay, I'm gonna let it warm up for a minute or two real quick. And then we can get going. All right, so it should be plenty warm. So hopefully the roads aren't too busy. It is after school, so there might be some buses or whatever. So I'm gonna put you guys down so I can drive. That is the inside part there. That's where the hydraulic oil filter is. So stick that bucket underneath it. You need to keep loosening it up. Okay. Take that filter off and just drop it in the bucket. What is this? Transmi mm -hmm. Is this a transmission? Transmission
Okay, so this door is where we're going in. And you may notice this thing right here. I'm not going to show you too much right now. Just because I don't know much about it yet. So I'll explain a little bit more in a later video. But again, I got this spring for the planter. So I'm just going to set this here for now. So we're probably going to have to move this cat. Because we need to get to the stock chopper and the sprayer. Okay, so here's the stock chopper. As you remember from a different video. And then here's our Demco sprayer. This is what we need to get out. Um, because we are going to be spraying soon. So I think after we move the cat, we can get this out with the 4030, and then the sprayer will go on the 3150. One tractor to the next. Okay, raise it up, pull back slow. Okay, pull her back. Pull her back. Raise her up. Oh, look at that. Let her down some. Oh, okay, raise it up. More. Oh, yeah. I was afraid of it. Down. Oh. 
no more. Should do it good. Oh, oh, it's hooked there again. Ah, dang it. There. Turn, stop right there. Turn your wheels all the way to the right. Front wheels, all the way. Hold your right brake and go ahead just a little bit. They'll swing that hitch out of the way. Good. Good. Now you can raise it up. Good. Lower there. Okay, so I'm back under the planter now. We're gonna put this spring on. Shouldn't be too difficult. Alright guys, so I think the planter is done now. The spring's on, everything else is tightened. I don't think there's anything else that we're replacing, but I'm not 100% sure on that. So I got all my tools over here. So I'm not sure what we're doing now for today, but I guess we'll find out. All right guys, so we're pretty much done for the day. We did a few other small things, like the 3150 over there. Uh, we took the mat out, and we're gonna try and fix that ignition problem. Um, we got this thing here. Uh, I don't think you guys have seen this yet, but we took it off of a forklift for a three-point hitch tractor. So this thing has been leaking oil like crazy. So we're gonna put new seals in it or whatnot. 
We didn't really do anything on the flatbed. Um, I don't think I've showed you this for a while though. We have all these things set. And we're basically going to put a border around it. And then we're going to lay sheets of plywood on top of it. But anyway guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. Stay tuned for the upcoming videos because you guys saw we hooked up the planter. So we're going to be planting very soon. So again, I hope you guys enjoyed. Thanks for watching and see you in the next one.